for 7200 we need to find sum and number of all the even factors and sum and number of all the odd factors now if the factors will be divisible by 2 they will be even factors and if the factors of 7200 they are not divisible by 2 they will be odd factors now since the prime factorization of 7200 is already given here let us start exploring this so if i talk about the total number of factors and the sum of them what i have to do here i'll just expand this i'll just uh, write start uh, i'll just take any of the individual prime factors and write it with starting with the lowest power from 0 to the highest power available here so 2 to the power 0 plus 2 to the power 1 plus 2 square plus 2 to the power 3 plus 2 to the power 4 plus 2 to the power 5 this thing multiplied by 3 to the power 0 plus 3 to the power 1 plus 3 to the power 2 and again this thing multiplied by 5 to the power 0 plus 5 to the power 1 plus 5 to the power 2 on multiplying these three together i'll get sum of all the factors of 7200 but let us start with our first question we are asked to find the sum and number of all the even factors so let us talk about the sum of all the even factors now factor will be even only when it is divisible by 2 and if we'll see the if we'll see all the terms present here can i say that all the terms present here will be divisible by 2 it will be if we remove this one term present here 2 to the power 0 because this is actually equal to 1 1 multiplied by this thing and again this thing will give me 1 as a factor 1 multiplied by this thing and again with 5 to the power 1 will give me 5 as a factor this thing multiplied by 3 to the power 0 multiplied by 5 square will give me 25 as a factor so these are the factors which are not even they uh, they are not even so we can't include them in the sum of all the even factors so what i can do i'll just remove this 2 to the power 0 from here i don't want the terms without 2 so i'll just remove the first thing so now i have 2 to the power 1 2 square 2 to the power 3 2 to the power 4 and 2 to the power 5 and when i'll multiply th them together i know that all the terms will, will at least have a single 2 in them so anyhow i'll end up getting the sum of all the even factors only and hence this multiplication now will give me total sum of even factors present here and what will be that value so we can easily find that 2 to the power 5 is 32, 32 plus 16 plus 8 plus 4 is 12, 12 plus 2, 14, 14. So this will give me 6 plus 4, 10 and 12, 3, 4, 5, 6, 62. So this value will be 62 multiplied by 9 plus 3, 12 plus 1. 13 multiplied by 25 plus 5 30 30 plus 1 is 31 this thing will give me the sum of all the even factors and what about total number of even factors so the total terms present in this multiplication will give me total even factors so i have 5c1 i can take any one term from this and multiply them with any one term from here and multiply them with any one term present here so which is actually the total number of terms present here five times total number of terms present here total number of terms present here so this thing that is 9 times 5 45 will give me the total even factors so 7200 will actually have 45 even factors and the sum of all these even factors is given by the multiplication of these three things here 62 times 13 times 31 now let us move on to the second question we need the sum and total number of odd factors here now i know that if the number will not be divisible by 2 then i'll get the odd factor and the sum of odd factors so what i can do here now i know that initially what we did here we had 2 to the power 0 plus 2 to the power 1 this multiplication gave me all the factors of 7200 now in order to find the even factors we removed this first term now in order to find the odd factors i need to remove all the terms which have 
two in it because that two will make the factor even. So if I, if anyways, if by any means I can remove that two from this multiplication, all the possible twos here, then I'll get all the odd factors. So let me remove the remaining terms. Let me remove the remaining terms here because those are the terms only which will make the factors even. So now I just have two to the power zero, which is actually one. This thing multiplied by this, multiplied by this will give me all the sum of all the odd factors. So 2 to the power 0 is 1 multiplied by this thing is 13 multiplied by 31. This multiplication here will give me sum of all the odd factors, odd factors of 7200. And how many of them will be odd? So one term I have to pick from here. So 1 times 3 total number of terms present here and total number of terms present here. Three threes are nine. So 7200 will have only nine odd factors and 45 even factors. Together, both of them, 45 plus nine, 45 plus nine, that is 54, will give me all the total factors of 7200.